This is JC Masterpiece. Mario Kart Tour's third tour is the Halloween Tour. Okay, we've got the Lemmy Cup going here. <coughs> this is the second cup in this tour. And, ooh. Normally, I would go with Mario, with the um, Musician Mario, because I love the hat. But I'm going with Daisy this time with the Day Tripper and the BBIA Parafoil. Because it is Daisy Hill, so really should give credit where credit is due. Okay, get the turbo boost going. Daisy and the Day Tripper just seems appropriate. Yep, cut that a little too close. But that's all right because this is only early on, so mistakes like this aren't a big deal. I should still be able to get all five Grand Stars pretty easily. Fire off that red shell. Goodbye. And I stole his mushroom. Okay. And there is the shortcut off to the left there I could take. I may take that at some point. I'm not taking it right now. Okay, I was going to see if I could get a bounce off of that, but don't hit it. Don't hit it. <coughs> Ooh. If you were paying attention to previous races, I have hit that, the windmill thing, so many times. It is brutal. Okay. I've wrecked a number of races by hitting those windmill things. Propellers. I want to call them windmill propellers, but I don't think that's the right term. Okay. So, miss the goats. Don't hit the goats. At least not yet. Not unless you're looking for some sort of goat hitting combo. <coughs> Green shell. Still in first place. Cutting through here, which wrecks my, uh, my drift. Trying to get as much drift as I can. Can I get the bounce? I got the bounce, which I don't think helped me much. And it's a blue shell, so it doesn't really matter too much, does it? Okay, of course, blue shell right before the finish of the second race, of the second lap. Why is that not surprising? <sighs> okay, moving on. Second place was beaten at the last minute by Peach. 69-69. More than enough for five stars. And we are, whoop, got a, um, got a challenge. Completed a challenge. Got a star from that. One grand star. Ooh, got another grand star. Woohoo! for doing combos, lots and lots of combos. Lots of, yeah, drift combos. Okay, of the two, I prefer Morton over Ludwig because I really am not a big fan of Ludwig's um, bonus thing. Uh, bananas aren't overly helpful. They do protect your butt. But the, when the rings, the rings, they align themselves right smack dab in the middle. So if you ever use them either accidentally or on purpose, and you're not lined right up in the middle, then you can turn around and give your opponents the, an advantage over you by using your bonus, your help, you actually help your opponents. So I really don't like that one as a whole. It's great if you can get them all yourself, but if there's any chance that you're going to miss them, then there's a good chance that your opponents that you will hurt yourself using it. Okay. So, but if you're really looking for combo bonuses, I can see that being helpful in a spot where you've got an empty spot where you can't really naturally get combos because then it'll get a, that'll give you, if you do it right, give you three extra com parts to a combo where you normally can't get it. So in some instances, it's, it's that can be helpful, but it can also be very destructive. Anyways, moving on. Morton. We hit this on a regular basis, this train. Luckily, unlike in an N64 version, once you hit the train, you're stuck there. You can't go forward. Red Shell got hit while Luigi hit me. But for this one, they make it so that you bounce over the train. I don't know if it slows you down at all or messes you up at all, um, 
but it's not like the N64 version where it stops you, you, yeah, where you're better off putting the brakes on and waiting behind the train than hitting the train. Okay. <clears throat> that was race two in the Lemmy Cup. So far, we haven't seen Lemmy as a main character in his own cup. 65.54, more than enough for five stars. Not surprising this early on. Okay, finally we see Lemmy. And, ooh, Lemmy or Bowser. I'm gonna go with Lemmy, because this is his cup. And it doesn't matter so much. If it mattered, I would go with Bowser. He's my definitely my favorite of the characters. Of He and Dry Bowser are my favorite heavy characters. Um, but in this case, it is Lemmy's cup, so I am going to give Lemmy credit where credit is due. Go Lemmy! Tap that corner, which slows me down a tiny bit. Tap that one. Not enough to be super problematic. Yeah, you guys hit the, that thing. Ooh, and I did not get hit. I will take that as a win, even though I'm in second place, not first. Fire off my green shell. Got him! With the knockback on the green shell. Nice. Very nice. It's almost like I planned that. Wouldn't it be nice if you could plan that kind of thing? Okay, coming around this curve. Here we go. Can I hit it? Can I hit it? No, I missed it. I didn't hit it through the... Yep, that's the ink in the way. With these lighter carts and characters, that off... Uh, oh, seriously. Took seconds. With these lighter carts and characters, those things that would bog down, those spots that would bog down heavier carts or heavier characters don't matter as much. I mean, they do affect things, but they are not nearly as much of a problem. So that was Lemmy with Bullet Blaster and Bob Bomb Parafoil. More than enough for all five stars and on to the final challenge. And it looks like we've got Morton. So in the Lemmy Cup, only one race highlighted Lemmy. Jump boosts. Lots and lots of jump boosts. These are usually pretty easy to do to get three stars on. Not always, but usually. So we'll see how it plays out. Oh, I missed one off to the side. There we go. Getting knocked around doesn't matter so much as I catch those jump boosts. But I did miss that one bounce. Am I going to get the... Okay, there's two jump boosts here. I think that more inside track only had one, and then there's a third one. So inside track actually would have given me two instead of three. So by taking the outside track, I actually get an extra option. And I am going to make a very big mistake here and take the shortcut. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have done that. But let's see if it actually hurts me. This early on, oh, I caught all the coins. Okay, will I have enough? And that shot me up and gave me an extra one right there. Okay, will I have enough for three stars? I expect that I should, but taking that shortcut will definitely cut off a few. Yeah, no, I got three stars. Okay, so this has been Mario Kart Tour Halloween 2019 Second Cup Lemmy Cup. This is JC Masterpiece. Thank you so much for watching. Keep watching, subscribe, like, comment, and share the videos. The more that people share, the more that people like these, 
the more I can invest in making more. So thank you so much for watching, and have a great day, everybody.